Welcome everyone. This is the Empress. Guys, I'm back with another video for you guys. So, before we get into this video, guys, this is going to be a collective message. So, this is going to be for my collective, all right? So, this is pretty much every sign. Um, whatever messages come out, come out. It may or may not resonate with you. All right? So, if it does resonate, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Um, so we can keep the messages and the, the channel in flow and guys if you are new to my channel go ahead and click the bell to subscribe okay so briefly guys I want to talk to you about my money magnet oil all right so this is going to be a $27.77 bottle all right so all you simply do guys is dab someone you somewhere it could be on your shirt on a lucky charm on your hands and guys, when I say works magic, works magic, okay? Works magic. It smells amazing. It actually smells like money, all right? I do have a few, you know, added items, but this is a traditional recipe. But um, it does have a lot of, it packs a lot of extra umps, all right? But this is going to be a $27.77 bottle okay that is going to include shipping all right so if you would like to purchase the item the information is going to be in the drop box below and it ships out next day all right so soon as you order it or process and then it'll ship out that next day all right shipping is going to be three to five business days all right so if you would like to purchase guys that information is in the drop box below okay so let's get into it guys let's get into it let's get into it let's get into it a collective message please uh, show me what's going on for my collective okay what messages do you have for the collective please I got the King of Swords, the Judgment, the Eight of Wands. Some of you are thinking of something to say. <laughs> okay. Yeah, some of y'all are not sure what to say. Um, you're not sure if you should keep moving. <laughs> okay. Yeah, somebody. Okay. Let's talk, y'all. Let's talk. All right. So, at the bottom of the deck, I have the devil, which is... Uh, you know, being attached and bond, bonded to a situation. This is also, um, you know, negative habits. Um, this is sexual energy as well. And this is also the energy of Capricorn. But I'm getting somebody cut off communication with someone. Um, it's someone the situation is very toxic. It's unhealthy. Somebody is uh, focused on themselves now. Um, and possibly, um, you know, just drawn in and focused in on themselves, okay? Their pentacle, somebody is very focused on their pentacle right now. And I'm getting that somebody walked away, yeah. We got the Eight of Cups and the World card here. And then we have the Strength card. So some of you have the courage to walk away from a situation. And this is also the card of Leo. This situation possibly, most definitely was causing you, like, sleepless nights, uh, worry, anxiety. May have caused you, ooh, look at this, the Queen of Swords and the Five of Swords. Yeah, somebody is real pissed off here. <laughs> somebody is real pissed off. Somebody done pissed somebody off. All right, so King of Swords. Some of y'all are feeling in King of Swords energy. Cutthroat as hell. Okay, some of y'all are just, I'm just going to flat out say it, like, some of y'all are cutthroat in your, the way you are communicating to this person, 
okay because the eight of wands is here that's in it that's communication king of swords is saying that it's kind of brutal i got the page of swords energy the page of swords and the king of swords the page of swords is very much so my spy card but when i see these two together i think of someone that's immature and then someone that's a more mature which is the king of swords the page of swords is a very much more younger energy um and you know not as mature okay very immature actually so why is the king of swords here let's see i'm curious why is the king of swords here okay it's the two of cups some of you could be dealing with a Le i'm sorry a libra gemini aquarius or a pisces cancer scorpio but someone here is thinking about the relationship okay thinking about a bond a connection okay with the three of pentacles with the three of pentacles this is saying that somebody wants to work on a relationship okay so somebody's wondering you know what they're going to say to try to fix something here or to try to um someone's wondering if they should try to work it out i'm getting that as well why's the two of cups here okay we got the strength card you could be dealing with a leo okay but somebody uh is a liar cheat a sneak with the seven of swords here somebody told a lie with the knight of cups okay the knight of cups is messages um somebody sweet talking someone to get something that they want out of someone and someone is just flat out tired of it four of cups in the in the four of swords somebody's intuition was telling them somebody intuition somebody intuitively you guys possibly are already intuitively felt this coming why is the judgment card here okay a final decision So now someone's considering should they wait, should they wait um, to make this final decision? Because we got the tower card here. Something happened. Why is the tower card here? Somebody abruptly left, okay? Eight of Cups. Somebody left and everything just fell apart. And they left fast. They, like, I'm getting like somebody got the hell on. Okay, the Chariot and the Knight of Swords. This is someone getting in their car and leaving fast. This is like, they left so fast. Somebody stormed out. You was looking for this person. Hoping that y'all could work this out. But they walked away. They walked away. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Some, Okay. You're hoping that some this someone can talk some sense into this person. Um, I'm getting King of Pentacles, the Nine of Wands. This person is very guarded. You could be dealing with the Earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But this person is very guarded. They got their guards up. Um, and I feel like they are, so, someone feels as if they made a mistake. Or you feel like this person has made a mistake. Um queen of cups and the lovers there could be a pisces cancer scorpio involved um or this is a could possibly even be like a love triangle with the lovers here and that queen of cups i'm getting queen of cups um i'm getting leo with the strength card here as well i got libra here as well too why is the eight of cups here yeah the five of swords Oh, somebody stabbed somebody in the back. The Five of Swords and the Ten of Swords. And the Empress and the Seven of Wands. I'm getting that somebody, you feel betrayed by this person. Why is the Page of Swords here? Now you're spying. You're spying. I'm getting, you could be spying on a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or a King of, King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Okay, so I'm getting like, there's somebody put somebody in a third party. Somebody here is in a third party. You've been giving this person money, not a little bit. 
Not a little bit. Uh-uh. Not a little bit. We got the six of pentacles. Somebody that's very generous. Somebody that will give their last, okay? The six of pentacles, the ten of pentacles, and the ace of pentacles. So you have been giving this person money. You've been helping this person get up on their feet, and they put you in a real bad situation, okay? Even when you didn't really have it to give, I feel like you gave it to this person with the two of swords and the queen of pentacles. I feel like you were very, um, you were very given when you shouldn't have been. Yeah, see, knight of cups. There, a lot of earth energy here as well, too, as water energy. But you don't, you may have decided that you weren't going to be as giving to this person anymore in the recent past. And they possibly got mad as hell. Future energy, we got the Ace of Wands. Ooh, new money. I'm getting like, you're going to be feeling like new money going in the future. All right? You're possibly going to be isolating yourself and working on yourself. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? I'm getting a new, new. Some of y'all are going to get a new man, a new woman. Ooh, you don't want somebody who somebody here could be married. Four of Cups and the Four of Wands. Okay. Um, You may feel like this person isn't your fl your twin flame. You may feel like you and this person do don't belong together. Um, because there's a lot of deception, a lot of lies with the seven of swords and the moon. It's just a lot. It's just too much sneakiness going on. Too much sneakiness. Like they tell you one thing and they do another. Like I feel like you're you're gonna be looking for something new. I'm feeling like you're looking for some a faithful person, an honest person. Um, with this hierophant here, it could be a Taurus. Um, but I feel like you're going for something new. Two of Pentacles, but I still feel like currently you're still in an undecided phase. Even though you feel all of these emotions right now, I still have you juggling here. You could be juggling two or more people, or you just haven't made up your mind. Okay, the chariot and the, the six of swords. <clears throat> I'm getting that someone possibly has like a new card, the ace of cups. And the Six of Swords and the Chariot. I'm getting like somebody has a new car or something. Um, why is the Chariot card here? You could be dealing with the Cancer. The Lovers. Yeah. So somebody, you feel like you're in a, a Lovers Triangle. Two of Pentacles and the Lovers. Somebody needs to make it. You need to make up your mind on how to move forward. Okay. So you are in an uncertain place because your guard is up. Okay, your guard is up. This person is possibly rushing his way back in um, to try to talk to you. But I feel like I feel like you are just in you, you have you need to make up your mind. Why is the lover's card here? These cards came right back out. Four of Cups and the Four of Wands. Like don't are if someone isn't interested in something long term or someone doesn't want someone uh why is the four of wands here the moon someone doesn't want to be a secret you don't want to be a secret you don't want to be you don't want to be hidden okay oh wow you're waiting for something to be done and over with and for this person to get over something. Someone could possibly be married or live or there's a live-in arrangement. Okay. The sun card and the five of wands. Someone's very competitive, competitive, competitive. And there somebody's regret um that they put this fight in, that they are you know were was fighting for someone that's a liar and a cheater so i'm not sure who's doing the sneak are y'all both doing this sneak this sneaky stuff are there all types of is there two different um the love triangles here but somebody feels like someone they feel like you um are being dishonest at times as well with the seven of swords here they feel like you're sneaky and as well as like you're very competitive 
The Sun card could be dealing with a Leo. And they also want to make you feel, want you to regret. I'm getting like there was an argument or there's some competitiveness, okay? Somebody, they're deciding to also keep their distance. They're trying to keep their distance. Four of Pentacles, Two of Wands. And I'm also getting two. Don't get it twisted because they stay ready. But they're, they're trying to keep a little bit of distance for now. Why is the King of Wands here? You could be dealing with the fire sign. You want to take action so bad. But you're guarded. Your guards is up. Why is the Three of Swords here? Oh, somebody getting cut off. There's going to be like... Somebody is... I'm getting ice box where my heart used to be. Somebody's heart is so cold. I'm getting somebody's heart is so cold, okay? Like, when this is all over and said and done, somebody's going to be... We got the Three of Swords and the Queen of Swords. Ooh, you I already don't want to piss the Queen of Swords off. And then the Three of Swords, you hurt her heart. This is, like, the worst person that... You, Worst person's heart you could potentially break. Ooh. Okay, well, we got the temperance, okay? So, somebody here, I feel like you guys are going to end up end up healing over this situation. Okay, but I feel like the truth needs to, is going to be, is going to be revealed. Okay, to someone's family or, or I'm getting like a marriage. Um, and then I feel like some of you may be really, really zoomed in and focused on yourself. But I feel like when this truth is revealed, this is going to help you heal. I feel like there's still some things that are in the dark. Um, but I do feel like someone is scorned here. Um, and it's going to take some, some time to heal and get over this situation. Um, so I feel like you guys are going to be really, really focused in on yourself. I'm getting this. You feel like somebody is a loser. Five of Pentacles um, and the Devil, the Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Why is the Temperance here? You could be dealing with the Sagittarius too. Yeah, see, I feel like we got the King of Cups. So I do feel like this situation, it was a stinger. But I do feel like you will heal and get over it. Okay, you will find your healing in this situation. I do feel like some of you are going to uh, open up your options. Why is the high thing here? Yeah. Um, but be careful of temporary hookups in the near future. Um, someone, someone could be using that as a way to cope with this situation. Like, you know, just random, like speed dating. Kind of like just, you know, uh, going out on a date and, you know, they're trying to get in bed with you as soon as they meet you. Like, some people try to use that as a form of healing. Um, but I do see a lot of options opening up in Seven of Cups. Okay, so the chance to meet someone new is on the horizon if that's something that you're looking to do. Um, but I do feel like there needs to be some type of closure. Somebody is, I'm getting like somebody is really scorned about a situation. Um, so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, guys. And I'm going to chat with y'all on another note. Ciao.